All right, y'all. It's time we talk about it, okay? Yep, in this video, y'all, we will be talking about Black Ops 6, my first impressions on Black Ops 6, how Black Ops 6 is doing, and what other gamers are saying about Black Ops 6, okay? Now, if y'all been on this channel for a minute, y'all know how excited I was for Black Ops 6. I wasn't too excited. Okay, I know better than to let this game get me super excited, but I was, however, excited. But man, y'all, this game is losing me, okay? It, it, it's losing me. I don't want to start the video off so negative like that, y'all, but the game is losing me, okay? Let's just be realistic here. The game is losing me. Okay, the first day, y'all, I had fun. It was action-packed fun. No. We're running up, the other team's running up, we're fighting, we're engaging and fighting. I mean, that's what Call of Duty and multiplayer is all about, right? Yeah, cool. All right, so day one, it was fun. Don't get me wrong, day two came. Day two came. More players were able to play the game then. And then guess what happened? It became a camping fest. I know some people in the comments are gonna say you're over-exaggerating. Yeah, maybe. Maybe, maybe so. Maybe I am over-exaggerating. Maybe I am thinking too hard into it. I don't know. But the game is not enjoyable to me, okay? It's not enjoyable. They brought back, what, Nuketown? <laughs> Did that make a difference? They're still not moving. I don't know, y'all. The camping is ridiculous. Yes, I am starting my video off, and that's what I'm focusing on is the camping. That's what got me kind of like, am I going to be playing Black Ops 6? Am I going to be playing Black Ops 6? I really don't know. I really had a written script for y'all, right? But the more I'm thinking about, about Black Ops 6, the more I'm going off my written script because this is what... It's coming to my mind right now. Black Ops 6 is not sitting well with me at all. I was super excited for this game, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I, I mean, I am lying there a little bit because I wasn't super excited. I wanted to be excited, but I knew better. When it comes to Call of Duty, you just can't be excited, okay? You just can't be. You just have to see what they give you and then work with that, okay? So, yeah, I wasn't expecting too much, but this ain't this ain't it. The beta was fun. This, this ain't it. It's like, I really be asking myself, like, is it really the camping? Is the camping really that bad? It is. Like, the camping can really change the game. Like, multiplayer is not multiplayer. I've tried core before. Somebody in the comments be like, well, try core. Y'all, you do is play hardcore. I know. I like hardcore. I like a one-shot game mode. I like that. Okay. And, like, right now in hardcore, is not hardcore. -ing. Okay. Hardcore is, I don't know. The time to kill is extreme on hardcore. I mean, I get more hit markers than anything. So, I even tried core. So, for y'all that want to say something, oh, play core, play something different. I did that. I went to core. I went to free fall. The camping ain't that bad in core, but the shots, the, the time it takes to kill is, is outrageous. I don't like core, okay? I was happy to see hardcore, but I'm still not happy about... I don't know, y'all. I could really ramble. Like, I'm already rambling off the script that I made. Like, that's how much I really have to say that I didn't know. <laughs> I let all this stuff, like, bubble in, and it's just like, huh. I'm not happy with Black Ops 6. I'm just going to sum that up. I'm not happy with Black Ops 6. I'm not happy with multiplayer. Multiplayer is like kind of what I was aiming for. You know, I wanted to, to focus on multiplayer. Not Warzone, not Zombies. Multiplayer. Multiplayer is just not it, okay? But that's enough of me rambling. I rambled way longer than I should have. Let's continue with the video. Let me get back on my script, okay? All right, so let's talk about numbers, okay? I did some Googling. I did some research on Black Ops 6. I sure did. I think I did, spent more time doing that than I did playing the game. Okay, I'm just kidding. I don't know, am I? Anywho, so they're saying that daily, y'all, uh, Black Ops 6 is keeping about 500,000 players. Um, I've been looking at Steam. Steam numbers have been great. A lot higher than what I'm used to seeing. That's for sure. Steam has been great. They've been keeping over 100,000 players. It's kind of hard to believe, but, I mean, I'm running into the same people in lobbies, but I don't know. Maybe numbers don't lie, right? Numbers don't lie. So if Steam is holding 100,000 players, then boom, whatever. Do I really believe that? I don't know. I don't know. But I would think that the Steam number, I would, I honestly believe that most people are coming from the Xbox Game Pass. I mean, it's free. But I mean, if Steam is saying that they're holding 100,000, I can just imagine how many people are on the Xbox Game Pass alone. So maybe those numbers are accurate. Maybe they are seeing about 500,000 active players daily. No. Um, so we have numbers to see how many people are playing, but how many people that are actually playing this game that are enjoying the game? I guess it's the question that I want to know. How many people are actually playing this game and you guys are actually getting on every day and like, yeah, this is fun. This is better than Modern Warfare 3. This is the best game that we've had. Like, how many people are honestly saying that? That's, I guess that's kind of what I, I want to know. So I did some research. And I've even went on Twitter and kind of wanted to see what people are saying about Black Ops 6, how people are thinking about Black Ops 6 and shit. Thinking about Black Ops 6, sorry. And these are some of the posts that I've seen. Right here we have someone saying, I generally don't know how some of you guys are doing it. I can't enjoy Black Ops 6. 
with how ridiculously trash the spawns. Oh, y'all, yeah, I didn't even talk about the spawns, did I? Hmm. Okay, I can definitely agree with the spawns in most of the maps are. Add the fact that skill-based matchmaking is as crippling as ever. This is the worst Treyarch launch I've ever played, sadly. How many of y'all agree with this? I mean, I do. I forgot to even mention y'all the spawns. We ain't even gonna talk about the spawns. Like, I literally only play Domination. I won't even play Hardpoint because the spawns on Hardpoint are ridiculous, okay? Um, the maps... We're gonna talk about the maps a little later. Um, got another comment here. The secret is to not play the multiplayer. I won't be until skill-based matchmaking is addressed and as it's one of the only games where it's broken. They're enjoying the campaign. I have not played the campaign. I have not cared that much to be like, okay, I'm gonna go play the campaign. I just won't play the game at all. Okay. That's my solution. Black Ops 6 ain't working. Play something else. Sounds good. That's what I've done. Anywho. I got more comments here. I told you I think I spent more time researching this than I did playing the game, okay? Black Ops 6 effing sucks. Straight up, the maps are trash. Now, the maps, I ain't gonna say they're trash. There are a couple that are my least favorite, but there are some good maps. I'm not gonna completely agree with that one. But the game feels like there's input delay. Oh my gosh. Now, that's another, th that's, a, that's something else I forgot to put in my uh, so-called script that we are, I'm already way past the script. I, I ain't even need no script. Okay. That's another thing, input delay. It's so bad on controller that, the input is so bad, the input delay I feel is so bad on controller, y'all, I went to mouse and key. Okay, keep in word, when y'all watching these clips in the back, y'all, I am on mouse and key. That's how bad, it's just, the game just feels weird. It does not feel how it did on beta. So yes, I am on mouse and key. Mouse and key, y'all, it actually feels really good on this game. So if you guys are on PC, try mouse and key. I don't know, okay, it works for me. But the classes and the guns are tired and boring. Okay, everything has been done a thousand times. Someone please make a fun FPS game again because COD is dead. He rated it a 5.5 out of 10. Like I said, y'all, there's more comments y'all can read them as they're on the screen. I'm not going to read every single one of them. Okay, so yeah, I ain't going to read every comment, but y'all y'all, get the idea right there, okay? Now let's talk about the maps. I told y'all, now this is part of my script, back on the script, y'all. I told y'all I was going to talk about the maps, right? Now, some people are saying that the maps are trash. I was really happy that we got 14 new maps. What's the 14? What's the 16? I don't know. I feel like I was playing the same five, so I don't really know how many maps dropped. Um. Okay, so just recently, y'all, they added Nuketown. Heard the hype. Nuketown's coming back. I was kind of happy. The thought of having Nuketown back, right? <laughs> right. Okay. Let me kind of give y'all the mindset so y'all can kind of see stuff how I did. Okay, so... First time I played Nuketown, y'all, was back, what was that, Cold War? I don't, I don't really remember, but I was, I was horrible at the game. Playing Nuketown gave me flashbacks of, I feel like I was horrible at the game again, because I was trying to run out and fight, and everyone was still camping. Y'all don't even really know what to say about Nuketown. Bringing Nuketown back ain't making the game no better. They still camping. How y'all camp on Nuketown? That's a good question. I'm trying to figure it out, too. How do, how do y'all camp on Nuketown? How? So yeah, I played a few games in Nuketown. I did. I did not have fun. Um, I continued to play even after the fact that I unchecked the Nuketown 24-7 thing. Yeah, it wasn't part of my hardcore playlist. It, it was gone. That's how much Nuketown didn't make a difference for me, okay? No. <laughs> Bringing new maps aren't going to change. I'm just really just coming to the conclusion that this is the new way to play COD. These are the new COD players, and this is how, this is how you play COD now. COD isn't about movement. It isn't about anything it's just about aiming down sight and walking footsteps are so loud that people aren't moving they're just listening to you like i'm not even making this video to complain i'm just really just making the video just because this is call of duty now like i don't know how much more i'm gonna be playing call of duty to be honest with you guys i might just take a break for this one might sit this one out like i said i was super excited at the beginning y'all to do my prestige and my camera grinds but now after playing the game it's just not i don't have the urge to do any of it Honestly, we're being honest here. I, I just don't have the urge to do it. Um, I don't even think I care anymore. Um, back to my script. Let's see if I missed anything while I was rambling on because I have so much more to say. Um, oh, let's talk about the hit markers. I kind of went over it earlier. Hardcore don't feel like hardcore. The time to kill TTK is extreme right now. That's another point. I guess I'm just going to throw out there that TTK is crazy. Yo, I'm bored making the video. Like, it's just crazy. I'm bored talking about Call of Duty. That's just how much I'm just not in. I'm not there anymore with Call of Duty. But I do got some more good stuff to put out in this video. Y'all, this ain't going to be an all bad video. I don't downplay any game, okay? I did a little bit, but we ain't going to focus on that. There's some good stuff in here. Keep watching the video, y'all. Some good stuff that's coming. Zombies. That's one good thing I can say about um, Black Ops 6, y'all, is zombies. Zombies is good. 
I ain't got nothing bad to say about zombies. I like how the maps are super big. Four people don't have to be in one area anymore. You can literally hold down your own little spot. I ain't got nothing bad to say about zombies. Zombies, go there to rank your guns up. <laughs> go there to level up faster in prestige. Zombies is fun. Zombies is fun regardless if you're playing by yourself or if you're playing with a team. Zombies is fun. The round based fun perks that they added, fun. Zombies is overall fun. If y'all spent y'all money on Call of Duty, don't let it go to waste. Go play zombies or go play campaign, I guess. Um, like I said, I have too much bad stuff to say. See, zombies is a good thing. I go on zombies y'all with my shotguns. I went on there with a couple of marksman rifles, which was really bad, but I actually ranked my guns up even though I died really fast. I do want to try a pistol. I want to try to pack a punch of pistol. I do want to try that. So I'll probably be back on zombies sooner than I thought. I don't know when. I don't I don't know. I haven't thought about Call of Duty. Um, um, how can we fix this issue on Black Ops 6, y'all? How can we fix the issue that everybody can't be? Turn the game off and not turn it back on? Duh. I mean, that's the number one answer. I think I need to tell myself that. Turn the game off. Don't turn it back on. How can you fix the camping issue? Don't play the game. <laughs> That's a simple answer. Yeah. I don't know what y'all want me to say. It ain't rocket science. I, I'm, about to tell, I'm telling myself that every day. I be ready to uh, play Black Ops 6 and I be like, huh, how can I avoid <laughs> running into campers? <laughs> not playing this shit. <laughs> Let's turn it off. Don't play the game. Am I just kidding or am I not? I think, I think I'm serious, but since I'm making a video, I'm trying to make it fun. But I, I'm, I'm really not joking. I think I might really take a break from COD. If you don't see me playing Black Ops 6, if y'all don't see a lot of Black Ops 6 content, y'all know why. Y'all know why. But then again, we do have Season 1 that's approaching, and they might be changing stuff. I'm not going to give up on it. I didn't give up on X Defiant. I still be playing X Defiant. I mean, I'm not going to give up on COD. I just know how to fix the issue. Don't fucking play it every day. Duh. I, okay. Um, maybe when Season 1 drop, y'all, I mean, they, the game new. They're going to add stuff. They're going to fix stuff. And maybe when they do all that, that's when I'll come back. But that's all I got in this video, y'all. I told you I wasn't all bad, wasn't all good. This is my, this is my thoughts on Black Ops 6 right now. This is how I thought. Like I told you, I wrote a script. I don't think I needed a script. <laughs> I had so much shit I wanted to say. <laughs> but to sum it all up, this game is trash right now. It is. Did I say that? I did. I said it was trash. I think I'll ever say that. But it is. But we got plenty of room for improvement, and I'm here for that okay but that's all i got for y'all thanks for watching and thank y'all for watching this video drop your thoughts in the comments anything that you guys want to add feel free to drop it let me know y'all thoughts on black Ops 6 i'm letting y'all know my thoughts okay let's share <laughs> our thoughts let's see if we think the same or if we don't mm. but if you are enjoying this game y'all let me know what y'all enjoying are you guys enjoying multiplayer zombies campaign whatever it is <laughs> let me know what y'all enjoying maybe i can start enjoying the game <laughs> I don't know. Like, I can't even take this video serious. Can't even take COD serious right now. No, don't even take me serious, okay? But if y'all enjoyed this video, y'all hit that like button, hit that sub button, stay tuned for my next video. Because one will be coming very soon. Will it be COD? I don't know. Probably not. 